just wrapped up work maybe this is not a good idea i'm too scared to like smash it because this one is made up of glass so i accidentally tossed out the straw that it came with hold on let me make a makeshift hole okay oh no no i need to make a bigger hole i think this hole is big enough Whenever I need a pick-me-up, boba is always the way to go. This one is mango pomelo. So when I had ordered, I had ordered two mango pomelo. One for afternoon, for midday, because I was feeling so sluggish. And one to power through the evening. It is a short week for us since we have off on Thursday. I think Friday might be less busy because a lot of people will be off. I was assuming actually people will be off starting today. That wasn't the case. And people are actually working tomorrow too. I wasn't expecting that because I have a few calls tomorrow as well. So today is it's kind of like a sunday reset i would say but it's not sunday it's tuesday evening around 7 20 p.m now we are doing a reset most likely multiple days reset i would say hey guys if you're new here my name is tisha and i live in new york city by myself with my dog chape here on youtube i create videos about my daily life and how i'm navigating my 30s in the city home to try these out. It's the ghost pepper potato chips. So while I was busy eating chips, I forgot my eggs at Trader Joe's. And I was thinking to make egg curry in that way when the eggs are boiling, I was thinking to start my workout. I'm gonna do a very quick grocery haul before I start cooking. Ghost pepper potato chips. I thought this one would be super spicy since it is ghost pepper, but at least for me, it's not spicy. And then I got this fudgy cookie dough. Then I got spinach, shiitake mushroom. I really don't know how to pronounce this. It's a flourless green bread. And I think the pronunciation is Ezekiel bread. Then I got chickpea pasta and then tomato basil pasta sauce, avocados, toasted granola, seaweed, ground chicken. I might do butternut squash and ground chicken then pork dumplings, and then garlic naan. I got this tea for nighttime. To be honest, I mainly got it because of the packaging, because it says well-rested herbal tea. Then red peppers. I got two red peppers. So the total bill for this is $61.02. I feel like we haven't done a vlog where I have cooked. I think it's been a very long time. To be honest, I haven't been cooking, cooking either. Oh no. I was supposed to wash this. That was very stupid of me. Guys, it's 9.45 right now. 9.45 p.m. I didn't work out at all last week. Last week, there was so much going on. Typically on a weekday, I don't really go out and about. But last week, I had an event on Tuesday that I went with Ashanti. It was our first fashion event. Wednesday was just regular. Going to work, therapy, and then to my sister's place as well in Jersey. And on Thursday, I went for drinks after work. And then on Friday, we did like a small picnic after work. But to be honest, last week was an exception. And I'm still recuperating from it yesterday i was literally a couch potato lately i know people call this as rotting so yesterday was literally a rot day for me and today i'm actually forcing myself to do things otherwise today would have been a rot day as well in between sets i'm mixing my dinner and then once this is done i will pause my workout and then i'll cook rice multitasking literally Pause my workout so I can take this out.
Chapi always takes a. Oh no! Well, that's what I get for multitasking. So I had this lid on, so the water overflowed. What I was saying before the water overflowed was that Chapi always takes half of the yoga mat. So my workout ended, and the rice is cooked as well. I'm gonna do like a rice bowl. I think all my plates are in the sink right now. All of it's from today. I always wash my dishes before I head to bed. I never did that in the past when I lived in Jersey. When I moved to my first New York City apartment, since I used to have roach issues, I used to make sure I used to do dishes throughout trash every day. And now that habit is ingrained in me. Any dishes I use throughout the day, I just let it sit in the sink and then I wash it all at night. Today I had breakfast, lunch, I had snacks. So I ended up using all my plates. I'm using my lunch box. I'm gonna add this on the side as well. Because the butternut squash is a little bit sweet. Is this even ripe? I know my dinner does not look aesthetic at all, but at least it's healthy. It has rice on the bottom, butternut squash with ground chicken, one full avocado. It is around 11.40 now. So I still have to do dishes, walk chape. So I deleted my TikTok because I was getting very addicted to TikTok. And then I replaced it with Instagram Reels now. Right before I sleep, I'm on Instagram Reels, watching random videos, and sometimes just googling the most randomest things because it pops up in my head for some reason right before I'm trying to sleep. So I'm gonna try not to use my phone while I drink my tea, finish this off, and then I'll head to bed finally. I went to buy eggs, but I ended up doing a mini grocery. I guess this video is going to be filled with grocery haul. I end up going to two grocery stores. First one is this kombucha drink. I definitely think kombucha is like an acquired taste. Then I got this Japanese meal. So I end up getting these two hummus. This one is spinach artichoke and this one is lemon twist. I got some carrots. I mainly got the carrots to eat it with the hummus. This is mainly to offset all the chips that I had yesterday and today. Remember that chips that I got yesterday? I finished the whole bag. Yeah, I do need to get some healthy snacks for work. And I got roasted sesame oil, the OG fried chili oil, then eggs. Finally, two gallons of water. Is it a gallon? I think it is a gallon, right? So the plan for today is to complete cleaning the apartment, living room, bedroom, kitchen, bathroom. I really don't want to do it because it is the evening before the holiday. So my future self, as in my future self in a few days, will be very happy that I end up cleaning today and finishing majority of the things because right now it is a bit of a mess, especially the bedroom. The bathroom also is kind of all over the place right now. This kind of happens almost every week when I'm done with the editing rabbit hole because on the weekday I'm busy with my corporate job and at the same time I'm trying to manage editing as well and whenever I'm in that rabbit hole I don't really put things in its place let's say for my jewelry I'll take it out put it on my uh, dresser instead of putting it in the jewelry box like these small things I don't know why I do this but at the end of the rabbit hole once i'm done with it once i'm done with youtube editing then i try to bring my life together but today it's not just my regular bringing my life it's just i need to vacuum mop and clean as well because it's about time i think i'll tackle the bedroom first and then i'll make dinner as well i do have leftovers from yesterday but i think i'm gonna make something different so this is the state of my bedroom right now it's a mess i didn't get a chance to make my bed in the morning so that's a mess and then this is my laundry that I did almost two weeks ago that I need to put away. I do have clothes still in my laundry bag as well that I need to put away. Now I have clothes that I had tried on or clothes that I've actually worn on top of the drying rack. And then I have makeup as well as jewelry that I need to put away. So all the outfit that I wore last week it was all piled up here.
finally done cleaning the bedroom. So much better. Earlier, it was so much chaos here because of all the clothes and even the bed was looking so sad. So while the salmon, so while the salmon is cooking, I will clean the living room. So the state of the living room is actually not bad. So I had my laundry over there which I did put away. I do have a couple of things to put away here as well. And then I do need to clean my office desk too. But beside that, the living room is so much better than the bedroom. I did make this I think a month and a half ago or like two months ago but that time I did not have the Japanese mail with me <gasps> and I dropped the whole piece and now I'm gonna put this on the seaweed could add a little bit of more mail cheers I'm definitely not finishing up cleaning today. After I ate, I was a couch potato for a bit. Either I'll pick it up tomorrow if I have time. If not, then Friday after work. This is literally multi days of me trying to get my life together. But then I did end up cooking both the times yesterday and today. So we're picking up where we left off yesterday. Today is a holiday for us and the original plan was for me to go to my sister's place. My sister's apartment building has a pool and a barbecue area. So that was the original plan. Spend time by the pool, barbecue and watch fireworks at night. But instead of that, I decided to stay home, rest up because I am still exhausted from the last week. So the last week was the previous vlog. We're kind of real time right now. Also. I really wanted to clean up this space so I'm prioritizing this which is somewhat a form of self-care where I recognize that I needed rest to recharge and beside that just cleaning my space so I'm gonna pick up where we left off I will clean up the kitchen I just need to sort out the living room a little bit I'm almost done there then the bathroom, foyer and we are done today I slept in and then Chabi and I we went for a long walk beside that I caught up on Instagram DMs as well as YouTube comments So I'm finally done with the kitchen. The kitchen looks so much better now. So I'm done cleaning the living room. Living room to begin with, it wasn't that messy. It was just a laundry that was in this corner that I had to put away. Beside that, it was pretty decent, but you know, after cleaning and mopping the floor, it always looks better. We had switched the layout in, I think, two or three vlogs ago. Initially, the couch was on this side, and then the TV and the dresser was on this side, so it was flipped. I still haven't decided if I want to switch to the previous layout, as in move the couch back to its original position. So I did ask feedback in that YouTube video and the comments were pretty split, I would say. I'm still debating if I want to flip it or not, but at least for time being, it is going to stay this way. I don't want to move stuff around right now. So this one broke a couple of days ago. The other one is still sanding. Both of these are from the previous tenant. And these sticky things are so hard to remove. I'm using a butter knife. This is so hard to remove. I 
Lovely. Whenever I clean, especially the bathroom, it's the fume sometimes. So whenever I'm cleaning, Chape is always in a different room. So earlier too, when I was cleaning the living room, Chape was in the bedroom. Right now he's still in the bedroom. But like last time when I was cleaning the bedroom, he was in the living room instead. So I make sure Chape is not around. I should have worn the gloves earlier itself because I used too much of... What was it? Where did it go? This one. Earlier when I was cleaning the bathroom um, sink, I had used a lot of this and I was using my bare hands to wipe off the Clorox and the tip of my fingers right now feels a bit sensitive. Whenever I clean the bathroom, I kind of spray a lot because there's a lot to cover plus it's the bathroom. Mm. I don't have proper ventilation in the bathroom. Like I don't have an exhaust fan. I don't have a window. I do have like a rooftop window there up all the way there but obviously i can't use that or maybe i can use it but at least i can't use it in the evening or night and right now mm, and right now i have you guys up on my laundry basket i push you guys all the way back so i can keep the win not window sorry i can keep the doors open in the bathroom or maybe i just need to wear a mask that's it <laughs> I'm finally done cleaning the bathroom. This is such a big difference compared to earlier. So much better, so much brighter and cleaner. And I'm done with the foyer as well. These boxes, I'll take care of it tomorrow. With this, I will end the vlog here. I really hope you guys enjoy coming along with me, trying to get my life together because it has been somewhat all over the place. And if you enjoy the video, don't forget to like and subscribe and support the channel. Whenever you interact with the video, either it could be like, comment, subscribe, or just watching or sharing. It helps YouTube algorithm to push out the video to a larger audience. If you have an Instagram, my Instagram is Tisha Shrestha, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.